Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the start of year two in the Albuquerque Vipers franchise in Madden 07. We did not have ourselves a very good preseason. I played a little bit of it, didn't record really anything. We finished out 0-4. Uh, still not a great team despite all the moves made in free agency. And then you saw there, we signed another cornerback to add some depth to the roster. Week 1, and we are going to be traveling to the New Orleans Saints. They were a playoff team last year, almost went to the Super Bowl, lost in overtime to the Chicago Bears, who ended up winning the whole thing. We're traveling to their place, so this is going to be a really tough game. Uh, we are a better team than we were last season, but I'm not sure if we're going to beat a team like the Saints. We do have a teams like the Buccaneers and the Cowboys on our schedule, so I'm hoping... You know, we can beat teams like that. The Saints might be a little bit of a tougher one. Minter, he's back there returning for us now. Glenn Nash, he's too good. I don't want him getting hurt on kick returns. Minter, he's down to our third string cornerback. So I, I, I like him back there. We won't be as hurt if he gets hurt. Orlando Cross taking off on second down, picking up a solid gain. Third down into Michael Bennett, a big one to the right. He's across the 50. A nice run there by Michael Bennett, the new running back here in Albuquerque. He gets the handoff again, going up the middle, jumping over defenders. And that might be a first down there. Not quite. Second and inches. Orlando Cross, his first pass in the NFL is completed to Harris. First down and 10. He's dropping back to pass yet again. Going deep to the left side. And this is tipped in the air and intercepted. So unfortunately, he throws his first career interception before he throws his first career touchdown. Just his second pass goes for an interception. It did kind of bounce off the hands of Charles Phillips, the rookie, though. So that's not all on cross. Saints are going to give it to the fullback up the middle on second down. He picks up a solid gain. On third down, it's going to be play action. Breeze going to his tight end on the right there, and that moves the chains. On first down, they give it to the reigning rookie of the year, Reggie Bush, who loses two yards there. They're still going to give it to him again here, and this time he'll pick up some yards. Third down and eight. Breeze going five wide here, trying to pick up the first. Going to the left there, and it's caught by Johnson, and he's into Vipers territory. A big play there for New Orleans. Breeze throwing this one to the right, going deep again. Caught, but out of bounds, overthrowing his man there. On second down, it's going to be play action, and this one's going to be broken up by Ike Taylor, another big free agent we brought in last offseason now. Breeze looking to pass, and he cannot connect with his man there. A good play by Ike Taylor, and they're going to have to punt. So a good stop there on defense. Can the offense do something? Two-yard run there. Cross going to the right side. Broken up there by the linebacker. Almost intercepted, potentially. Cross is looking to pass. He got hit as he let that one go. Falls incomplete. And now we have to punt. The Saints, they have decent field position here. And Reggie Bush makes that much better with that nice run. Picking up a quick first down. Bush getting the carry to the left. Picks up about five yards there. On second down, they're going to give it to him again to the left side, and he picks up the first down in there once again in Vipers territory. Reggie Bush getting the handoff once again, fighting through tackles, and another first down. He's been the workhorse of this drive so far. Now Breeze, he's going to pass, going to the end zone, and broken up incomplete there. That would have been a play that last year's Vipers definitely would have given up for a touchdown. So even though it wasn't really a bat down, Darnell Bing did get in the way of the receiver. And that led to no touchdown there, but it doesn't matter because they get a touchdown on that play. Working on Ike Taylor, and the Saints are in the end zone. You knew it was going to happen eventually. Look at the replay here. Stallworth, I believe that was. He's one of the fastest receivers in the league, so no surprise that Ike Taylor, a decent cornerback, but still got beat there. Michael Bennett, a big run to the right side. I'm really liking what I'm seeing from him so far. Orlando Cross has yet to do a whole lot, but we're kind of playing conservative right now. There he misses Drew Bennett. On second down, Michael Bennett running, and he will pick up a handful of yards there. Third down and seven. Cross, he finds Bennett there, and that will get us out to midfield. A good play on third down. Now Michael Bennett, he's running to the left, and that's a nice gain of six yards. Give it to him yet again, the workhorse today. We got two speedy workhorses, one on each side of the football here. 
cross rolling to his left he's got some good wheels throwing on the move incomplete but look at this replay here he that was a great throw in right past two linebackers Bennett's not quite able to bring it in but he could have that was in his range and with his 97 speed he could have done a lot of damage in that open space so an incomplete pass but I thought it was worth throwing a replay there Cross is rolling to his right. He's running around and he's just trying to do too much. Getting sacked at about midfield there. That's going to lead to 4th down and 20. And now we're going to have to punt. We got a new punter in the offseason. He's got a nice little headband. He's going to punt this one away. This one could be a good one. He gets knocked back and then it gets screwed up by our other special teams player there. I'm not exactly sure who that was. We could have pinned them deep, but instead they get the ball at the 20. Second down and five. Breeze, look at that big old vision coin going to the left side there. And Henderson, a big reception there. And once again for the third time today in Vipers territory. Reggie Bush only picks up a single yard. Going to the left for Bush and incomplete. He went to gun very far had he caught it anyway. Third down and nine. Breeze in the pocket going to the end zone. And this one's intercepted by Adams there. A great play. And we have our first turnover this year. Drew Brees forcing that into double man coverage, got tipped into the hands of Adams. A fantastic play here by the secondary, which is 100% brand new from what we saw last year. So now Orlando Cross trying to put together, put together a two-minute drill. That screen pass falls incomplete. Going deep down the left here looking for Phillips. He's got really good speed, 96 speed, but unable to bring that in. A high snap here, going deep, Glenn Nash, what a catch, and there was pass interference, oh my goodness. Glenn Nash, he's 30 years old now, but still making these spectacular plays that he did last year. He's not the highest overall, but man, you keep making plays like that, I don't care what your overall is, you're starting on this team. Going deep here, and it's caught Charles Phillips, the rookie, the fourth round pick. He has blazing speed though, and that's a big time catch there. Bennett has the reception, and that makes this first down and goal. Give it to him again, and he is in the end zone. Touchdown, Albuquerque Vipers, and this game is tied up at seven apiece. So the first points of the year go to Michael Bennett, the former New Orleans State. He played for them last season, so a little bit of a revenge game for him. Michael Bennett, not Michael Bennett, Reggie Bush, the Saints are on offense now, picking up a good chunk of yards there. Breeze going deep, and he's got a man open! He's wide open, and Drew Breeze overthrew him. That was 100% a touchdown. Our secondary was beat, but Drew Breeze unable to capitalize there, but they do convert on third down with that run. They burn a timeout, now Breeze going to the right, and it's caught by Haas. So the Saints trying to do a little two-minute drill of their own here. Breeze again going over the middle. This one's intercepted. Jeff Earlbridge with the INT. And that's two interceptions thrown by Drew Breeze in this first half. Now we're trying to get a little bit of more points here before halftime. Going deep for Phillips, but overthrowing him that pass, sailing out of bounds. Now we're going to give it to Drew Bennett trying to catch them off guard. And he picks up six yards there. Orlando cross rolling to his right, going deep, Glenn Nash, wow, what another amazing catch by him. Cross now, he's going to the end zone and broken up there by the cornerback. Second down and 10, Orlando cross got time in the pocket and this one's intercepted there. He had his man open but waited too long to throw it to him and throws his second interception of the game. That will bring us to halftime tied up at 7 apiece. The Saints get the football to start off this second half. They're going to start off with a run there. That picks up three yards. On second down and seven, Reggie Bush to the left side there, picking up the first down. New set of downs. It's the draw play now for Reggie Bush. He's getting himself a lot of carries. Going up the middle, picking up six. This is going to be play action now. Breeze going deep, and that one was almost intercepted. That should have been the third interception that he had thrown today. Third down and four and connecting with Stallworth and moving the chains there. New set of downs once again. Breeze trying to dump this one off to Reggie Bush, but just a little bit out of his reach. Well, caught, but uh, out of bounds. 
Bush running it up the middle. Nine yards there. Third down and one. Gave it to Reggie Bush. Spinning out of a tackle, but then Corals is there for the stop, and that forces the Saints to punt. So this defense looking much different than what it did last season, giving up, oh, I think, over 800 points. So uh, our defense looking good, but so is the Saints defense there as they get the sack. Second down and long. It just became third down and even longer back-to-back -back sacks. Orlando Cross going to the left side. Broken up there looking for Phillips. Reggie Bush. <laughs> Sorry about that. Just all over my words. They're just tripping all over myself. He's running up the middle. And then he's going to be hurt there. We'll get an update on him soon, I believe. Deuce McAllister, the backup running back. He's a solid running back himself, picking up a solid game. They give it to him again there, picking up three. An update on Reggie Bush. He's going to be out for the rest of the game, so Saints got to rely more on Deuce McAllister now. He gets the toss out to the right, but Ike Taylor is there to meet him for a minimal gain. Third down and six. Breeze throwing the left side and off the mark there, missing his wide receiver. So now Albuquerque trying to take the lead here. Cross rolling to his left. He's going to take off and run. He's got, I think, about 83 speed. Pretty good for a QB. First down and 10. Cross rolling to his right. Throwing up top for Harris. Who makes the grab? Gets some good yards after the catch. Knocked out at the 50-yard line. Bennett going up the middle. And a nice run there. Picking up three yards. Giving it to him again. Going to the right and picking up the first. Fresh set of downs once again. We're doing a good job moving the chains today. And we do it yet again there with Bennett. Another big run for him. And he's over 100 yards this game. We didn't have a single game where we ran for over 100 yards last year. Going to the left there. Almost intercepted looking for Phillips. But the cornerback did a good job following him there. Cross. Moving around, going to the end zone, so he's got a man open! Drew Bennett, the first touchdown pass in the young man's career. The first overall pick in this draft, making a spectacular throw on the move. Drew Bennett did a fantastic job getting open, got a little double move there. And just under six minutes left in the game, and believe it or not, the Vipers are in the lead in the fourth quarter. I'm pretty sure that's the first time that's ever happened in this franchise. Third down and seven now. The Saints looking to do something on offense going over the middle. Henderson has the reception. That moves the chains trying to tie up the game here. Drew Brees, he's not had himself a very good game thus far. Under 50% completion. One touchdown, two interceptions. McAllister to the right making a move. And finally wrestled down there by Minter but not until he picks up seven yards. Giving it to him to the left side. Tom Lang is there for the stop. Fourth down and three. They're going to go for it. They're going to give it to Deuce McAllister. And Deuce Deuce picks up the first. McAllister getting the carry again up the middle. Picking up five yards there. Toss out to the left for him as they fake the handoff to the fullback. Running people over but then brought down soon after that. Third down and four. Breeze is almost intercepted yet again. He's thrown two interceptions, and two interceptions have been dropped today, so definitely not his best game. Albuquerque's got the football again. Drew Bennett carrying this one to the right side and picking up the first. And the way he's been running today, we can run down a lot of this clock. We are at the two-minute warning, running it again there, and nice carry. Once again, Drew Bennett, the workhorse here, picking up a solid game. The Saints burn their second timeout. Now we got Michael Robinson in the game, and he's not going to be going anywhere there. Fourth down, just a minute left. Can Drew Brees do his thing and bring the Saints to overtime most likely here? Henderson has the reception. That's a quick first down there. First down and 10, faking the spike, going deep here, and that one's almost intercepted. Drew Brees could have thrown up to five interceptions, just like Peyton Manning did in the Super Bowl. That one tipped and off the hands of the defender. Drew Brees just off the mark a little bit today. Playing a little dangerous. Playing some, some Brett Favre football here. Faking the spike again. Trying to do what Dan Marino did against the Jets all those years ago. Hit as he let that one go. Incomplete. Under 30 seconds now. Brees throwing to the left and broken up there. I believe that's the newly signed cornerback that we signed before this game here. Going to the left, Henderson has the reception, and it's going to be fourth down and inches. 
Breeze. He's looking to pass under 20 seconds left in the game. He's going for it all and is caught but out of bounds. And believe it or not, the Albuquerque Vipers are going to upset the New Orleans Saints 14-7. Wow, I did not expect our first win in franchise history to come against a good team like the New Orleans Saints in the Superdome. Wowzers, the first career start for Orlando Cross. He is undefeated as a starter. Might as well retire now and just go down with 100% uh, win rate. Please don't retire, Orlando Cross. You look pretty good this game. One touchdown, two interceptions, just 167 yards, but... Uh, I mean, Michael Bennett was playing so good running the football today that uh, we had to keep running it with him. He had 119 rushing yards and a touchdown, averaging 6.2 yards per carry. Orlando crossed three carries for 16 yards, so he, he was uh, all right there. Looking at receiving Drew Bennett, the first touchdown reception for uh caught that is by uh, orlando cross thrown by orlando cross he caught the first touchdown pass that he threw there he can add that to his record uh, offensive line give did give up two sacks you know offensive line definitely improved but still not like fantastic uh we were unable to sack drew Brees, but we did pick him off twice that's going to do it for this video. A fantastic win here for the Albuquerque Vipers. And uh, I hope you guys have a moist rest of your day. And until next time, this has been Jeffrey. Goodbye.